Hey guys, what's up? Uh, Lou Intel here, and today we're I'm just making a action figure review, whatever. So here I have uh, the Assassin's Creed Connor. Here, um, okay. First, I'll start off with all the weapons. Okay. My main favorite weapon is the tomahawk. It's like right here. It's like a chromish color. Then, and then there's like, well, I don't like reviewing. And then after that, I'm gonna have another one, another small review. And the second one is his, uh, what you call it, gauntlet thing. And then. And then his uh third one is the bow. It's it's a string that actually works. So if you don't want you don't want to pull it too far else it'll snap. Um the uh, here's his flu flock pistol, whatever you want to call it. Uh, okay, there. And then, just like, all, you know, pistoly. It's like old time. Bam, bam. Um, now, here's the his other one. He comes with two. Oh, ow, it's so hard. It sucks. Pretty much the same thing, so yeah. And then, now what else? Oh yeah. So here is the figure. That says face. Um. Here, uh, his the back part. That's his. That's his bow or his arrows. Um, the whole thing's plastic. Um, here are the boots. They're like mock. They look like moccasins, but I don't think they are. Oh, what an assassin or moccasins. Um, right there's the belt with the Assassin's Creed logo on it. He has the. And then he has the belt, the or the thing to hold the thing on the. Here, I gotta put it down so that it. I'm just, just seeing if that. Okay, now here's the belt. The right there that shows the that that hooks keeps this on, but it doesn't come off. But and then like right here is the the holster for one of the guns. Right there. Dang it. Right. Right. There. There's the holster for for one of the guns. And then over here is the other one. There. And then he has um black or black or gray gloves, whatever you wanna say. And like biker gloves. And um It's a really awesome figure. I got it yesterday for 14 bucks at GameStop. One thing that's kind of dumb though is that I got it at, or I was looking for one at Toys R Us in California, but they didn't have it. They only had the Da Vinci's flying machine, I think. I was looking for one of these. I was looking for the Etsy, the legendary Ezio, but they didn't have it. And then <coughs> yesterday we went to Grand Forks and we saw, and then then there was. I, w I was messing around in GameStop while my grandpa was getting a haircut, and then we just got, and then I had like, say, 30 bucks to spend, so I got this, and Skate 3 for the Xbox, and this was for $14.99, so yeah, it's a pretty epic figure. And they also had Ed Edward Kenway, but he only came with swords. That kind of sucked. Okay, so now moving on to the next figure review.
I don't think it'll take that long. It's Darth Maul from Star Wars. I was just messing around outside on the trampoline. Felt like making them battle each other. Fun. Kept throwing them up in the air. And okay, Darth Maul. His ugly face. Everybody knows his ugly face. His ugly face is staring. And then, pretty much everything on was black. So there's not much stuff to say. And like right here, like this is cloth. This is cloth. This is cloth. And this is cloth. So yeah, that's pretty much all. And it comes with a hood, but I don't know what the hood is. It's outside, I think. I never brought the hood outside. I mean, outside of this room. And here's his lightsaber. I lost the other one, even though I had it for like a week. This I only had for a day. Okay, here's his lightsaber without the red stuff or the the the, the killing part. Red with a bunch of red buttons, or it's gray with a bunch of red buttons. Right here's the. Right there's the thing that you can stick it into his belt to hook it on. And then here's here it is with the blade. It looks pink. So yeah. I'll see you later. Wait, 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 wait. No. <laughs> okay. Um I think sometime once I get enough money if I get this year if I get ten bucks every week thirty weeks I'd get a GoPro so and I'm just worried about that GoPro I want one so bad so then that's what I'm probably gonna be making most videos about GoPros my friends will have them. all my most of my friends have them there's a one friend in my class the other friend below me and so yeah and just got back from Peterson Cooley Heart Scramble 2013. It's uh, it's just ba it's basically just dirt bikes racing around, and <coughs> and then uh, you just go through the hills and all that stuff. It's pretty fun. I went over the handlebars twice, and I and I uh, kept crashing and crashing. Well, mo most of the times I most the motor died. There's this huge hill down there, and I only made it up like twice. And then there's a. And then after. And after that, I was just messing around on my dirt bike. I wonder if we can take this off. Don't think so. So then, yeah, I went over the handlebars the second time it happened. It, I. It ripped my pants. And so I had to spend the rest of the day with ripped pants. It was pretty fun. So, uh, yeah, see you guys later.